fans and welcome to another video here on the Rusty Boxcar channel. We got a couple trains here that we caught on Memorial Day of 2021. My son and I decided to make the drive up to Caskey Yard in Hopkinsville, Kentucky and see what all was going on in the Henderson subdivision. It was extremely quiet, uh, at least the time frame that we were up there. Uh, there was a local job working Guthrie uh, that we just weren't able to get good footage of. And as we sat at Caskey, uh, there wasn't a whole lot going on there either. Uh, we went up to the North Caskey uh, crossing uh, off Caskey Lane. And as we got there, we heard that a Q513 was leaving the yard. So we broke down to uh, Pembroke, Kentucky and managed to catch this train there. Q513 is a manifest going from Avon, Indiana down to Radnor Yard in Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, so we'll get this train come by us, and then we're going to continue on our drive south. We're actually going to get ahead of it again. Uh, the next clip will be of it in Greenbrier, uh, and then we'll zoom down to the National Cemetery uh, to catch a second train. As promised, here is that Q513 again, uh, this time in Greenbrier, Tennessee. Uh, unfortunately, our good filming location in Greenbrier puts us on the same side of the tracks as we were in Pembroke, so it's a uh, nothing really different from the perspective here, uh, but definitely wanted to put it to film one more time, and then we will go on down to the National Cemetery.
And here we are at the south end of the National Cemetery. This is Q025. Uh, it's a daily intermodal train that runs from Bedford Park, Illinois, down to Moncrief Yard in Jacksonville, Florida. Definitely wanted to capture a train at the cemetery on Memorial Day. Uh, here lately we've been trying to get camera angles that don't get as many of the headstones in the shots as per uh, several viewer requests. However, thought it was important on this day to show as much of the background of the cemetery as possible. Obviously, we all know uh, how important these heroes and veterans uh, have been to our country, and Memorial Day is definitely a day to celebrate them and honor them. Uh, I think it's really, really cool what the local Nashville Boy Scouts of America do uh, every year at the cemetery. Both the Boy, Boy Scouts and the Cub Scouts uh, we'll spend the day going through the cemetery, generally on Friday uh, before Memorial Day weekend. Uh, and they will place a small flag at every single headstone in the cemetery. And they will generally leave those there until Tuesday morning uh, when groups come back in to remove those and put them back up for next year. Uh, so definitely wanted to capture that. It's just something to think about every grave in the cemetery having a small flag on it uh, it's quite a bit of work my kids did that uh, when they were in the scouts their their troops that they're a part of still do that uh, and so definitely pretty cool thing that they do and wanted to capture that and show all of you guys what that looks like
Thanks for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click on the thumbs up below to give us a like. Also, please click on the Rusty Boxcar logo on the right side of the screen to get a subscription to the channel. And send us a comment. Really enjoy reading all your comments and I try to respond to each one of them. Thanks and have a nice day.